Good morning from the bean. He got a haircut. Let's check it out. Um, it's a little uneven. Um, I'm still working on that, but he was pretty good this time. He didn't even try to bite me once. It was fantastic. I even got to cut like, I got to shave a little bit around his face, which he's never let me do before. Never ever. So you did so good, Bean. Yeah, look at him. He won't even look at me. He's so mad. So this is the aftermath. I, I did it in here because it is kind of cold outside. The new vacuum thing that we got is perfect for cleaning this up. And I also need to mop the floor. So there you go. Yeah. You cutie. Okay, so I'm trying to give Bandit a bath because I just gave him a haircut and he's hiding behind this chair that they always lay in. What a jerk. Bean, you gotta come out. Bandit, come on. <laughs> he does not wanna get a bath. This is gonna be fun. So Bandit got his bath. He's feeling much better, right? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> but now, um, I am about to uh, get this chicken ready. We, we buy chicken in bulk because it's, you know, it's a little bit cheaper that way. So I have been going through all of the bags that you guys have been sending us. Holy cow, we have so many. Like, they're awesome. I'm so excited. So I have my, my pick, really. I've got like every flavor in the whole world in here. I'm going to do this one in uh, paprika. Paprika chicken. It's our exciting day, right, Bean? Yeah, I got a hole in my sock. Hey. And now it's dinner time, so I'm making this so tender bag. It's paprika chicken. But instead of it being a bag, they're like these little papers that have like a lot of seasoning on them. You can kind of see the seasoning uh, here on these. They're it's very it looks like it's gonna be very flavorful. So I just have to flip it in a few minutes. It smells pretty good though. I'm excited. It smells pretty good though. I'm excited. It looks like I may whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, hold on. It looks like I may have gotten the temperature wrong. Because these are UK products, it said gas mark something something, and we don't have that here. We have like low, medium, you know, like I, I don't know what that means. So I think I might have burned these. Oops. Look who's here. I'm a Ninja Turtle. You are, and what are you eating? This is what I wore to work today. Oh, well, you know what? Um, You're not a Ninja Turtle because you're not eating pizza. Oh, well, that's true. <laughs> also, I don't have a cape. Oh, I had to take it off. Yeah, it's upstairs. Eating um, chicken? I made the paprika chicken. It turned out pretty good, I think. And no. some zesty fries. And this is uh, chick fil -A sauce. Yeah, it's just honey mustard and barbecue. Secret ingredient. And, um, oh, and salad. We had a true blue salad. I'm also going to use some Popeyes. Well, I just like hoard these sauces. Whenever we go eat anywhere and they give us extra sauces, I hoard them. Because one day I'm going to be like, oh, you know what? I want that Chick fil A sauce. Or that Popeye's bold barbecue sauce. And guess what? I'll have it. Yeah, we were supposed to go to Universal today, but I am worn out from yesterday. So, I'm not doing that. We're going to sit at home. We're going to watch a movie. We're supposed to, like, we're on three caballeros still. I don't know if we're going to watch that. <laughs> but. We did get Maleficent in the mail. Maybe we'll watch Maleficent. We'll watch Maleficent. That sounds yeah. like fun. Yeah. What the heck is that place? Um, I don't know. It kind of looks like butts. Came over here to talk to you guys because it's like Christmassy. There's a Christmas tree in the background. Uh, we just watched the BoJack Horseman Christmas special, which was awesome. And uh, I wish that there were more shows like that. If you guys haven't seen it, you should go watch it. It's on Netflix. I think it's only on Netflix, as a matter of fact. So we're watching this show on the Mayans, right? It's one of these like uh, shows about history and stuff like that. And it got me thinking, what happened? Like, the Mayans were around. And then whoever came after the Mayans and whoever came after them, who after came after them, whoever came after them, and then us, right? Why don't we know like what the Mayans were thinking? Why wasn't some guy like, hey, check it out, I'm a Mayan. Like, here's what I'm thinking. And then he says that to that person and that person says it to that person and so on down the road. And then we know what the Mayans were thinking. Like, where was the breakdown of communication in all of this? So we're watching this show about the Mayans, and they start talking about this friar, and they show us a picture of him. This is the best picture that you could paint of him. Look at his eyeballs. Why? Can you guys hear that? There's like something happening right outside. I don't know what it is. Let's go explore. All right? Are they like like caroling or something? I don't mean to be offensive or anything, but I have a feeling that they are a religious group, and I'm in my Ninja Turtle onesie, and I don't want to like have them come to the door right now. Right now is not the time for you to come to my door. Should we turn off all the lights? Bandit, what's all the noise? I think we avoided it. 
Maybe. I'm in my Ninja Turtles onesie. Come on. I had a hard day at work. I'm just like trying to sit down and watch a thing about ancient Egyptians and how they believe that they have a book that lets them like talk to dead people. Totally awesome. But let me get something straight here. I don't mind like uh, religious people or people that believe in, you know, whatever they believe in. I just don't like, I, there's no reason to come to my door. That's all. So far, my favorite thing that's happening right now is uh, I can still hear the music, but I can also hear a bunch of dogs barking at them. And then there was somebody else way over here that was just blasting their bass. This is awesome. And now the Tim Tracker Theater would like to reenact how that all just worked out. So we're sitting here. This is how we're watching TV. What the heck is that? <laughs> and that's exactly how it worked out. Oh, and then we jumped up and went to the front door. We have like a window on the door. And we were, and it was like a, tr a truck parked outside of our house with lights on it. And then we went. <laughs> I feel like I just Scrooge McDuck all over their like plans out here with their truck and their like song. Ooh, humbug. So I used to say to myself, I don't take naps. I can't take naps. That's not a thing that I do. I don't know why I was so adamant about this, but uh, apparently I do that now because totally fell asleep on the couch, which I guess would be considered a nap. It's not like I like sat down and was like, it's time to take a nap. And I fell asleep, but I just was sitting on the couch, fell asleep, woke back up, and now I'm like, like not as tired, but I'm still like sort of tired. Like I could go to sleep right now, but not as tired. So I guess I take naps now. All this talk about naps has tired me out. So I'm going to go to bed. Uh, tomorrow it's back to the good times and partying. Well, we're going to do something fun tomorrow for sure. So I will see you guys tomorrow. Now it's time to pay the price.